Hey, what's going on, guys? It's Dan here, and today I'm going to be continuing the Unity 3D tutorial series. In this episode, it'll just be a really quick one, like five minutes. And uh, what we'll be covering is we'll be making it the the uh, the bullets do damage to the player as well, but instead of one hitting the player, similar to how the enemies work, um, it, we're going to set up a basic health system. Okay, so uh, let's get started. So we. If you've been following along, you should already have something along the lines of this. If we hit play, uh, our enemy can do patrolling stuff. Uh, we can fire, we can, you know, we can get him to come after us and he'll shoot at us. Problem is right now is that it's very hard to not get shot. And I'll, I'll fix that in a later date. The problem is that I'll be heading on uh, vacation in a few days, so. It might not be as um, might not be as likely that I'll be able to record. So, if this is the only video that goes up, then that's the reason why. Okay, so let's get started with the uh, scripting. What you're gonna need to do is you're gonna need to open up your uh, player movement script. Wait for it to load. And at the bottom, we're gonna add a new function function on trigger enter it's new to the script it's not new to what we've been doing and then in the parentheses similar to how we always do it uh coal is an example of collider it's like nine in the morning right now and uh i'm not awake yet Okay, so we're going to do the typical if coal dot game object dot tag is equal to bullet. Oh. I almost forgot we needed uh, two variables. So var is hit. And that is going to be a boolean, which we'll set equal to. Oh, I'm not in it today. Uh, so we'll set that equal to false. And then our next variable will be hit points, which will be an integer, which we'll set equal to five for right now. Okay. So back down to the function we were just working on. In the if statement we're going to do is hit is equal to true. Now the reason why we won't do uh, hit points minus 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 is because the uh, on trigger enter only does booleans and the occasional you know destroying the game object it does it doesn't do uh, subtracting integers and floats so we can't do that in here we have to set a boolean and then do what we want in the um, update function so is hit is equal to true now inside of the update function below the uh, previous if statement which should be uh, the shooting but unless you've been adding stuff which is a good thing um, we're going to add a new if statement. In the parentheses we're going to do is hit. And then this is what we're going to do. Hit points. Minus minus. Um, so what this is going to do is if we're hit by the bullet, it's going to send us um, a signal by making is hit is equal to true. It's going to go to here in the uh, function update and it's going to subtract one from hit points but the problem is, is that we don't um we're not covering if i uh, the bullet exits us we're going to only con we're only going to cover if it makes contact with the player so what we need to do now is be in the is hit uh, if statement we're going to need to put down below hit points we're going to do is hit 
is equal to false. So that way, as soon as it subtracts one, then it sets it back to false again. So that way we don't keep taking damage from one bullet. And you can do this if you want to. I mean, it's not that important, but below it's hit, we can do destroy coal dot game object which basically it'll just destroy the bullet as soon as it hits the player and does all of this uh, simple enough now below is hit we're gonna do another if statement if no wait we don't want it we don't want to put it there I want to put it in here if is hit and then if hit points is greater than or equal to one else destroy game object there so you go ahead and save your script and then we return to unity actually I forgot to do one thing uh, before game object you need to do transform dot otherwise it'll give you an error okay so there we go if you go ahead and minimize it and turn back to unity uh, I'll get the make sure you have the player selected so that way you can you can check the uh, health because we don't have a, a system in place yet to show the health yet. So if we go ahead and hit play, as you can see my hit points are equal to five and as hit is equal to false. If I go over here and provoke our enemy by walking too close to him, as you can see he's shooting at me and my health is going down and it hit zero, next shot kills me. There you go. So uh yeah, I uh I'll be heading on vacation in a few days and it is unlikely that I'll be able to record anything while I'm there. So uh, if this is the only video that goes up for a week and a half, then uh, then that's the reason why. So uh, if you guys want, I'll, I don't know, I'll take pictures or record something of what I'm doing down there. But uh, you guys are probably not interested in that, so that's not that important. Anyways, uh leave any suggestions for future tutorials in the comment section below I'd be happy to take a look at them and try them in the future uh, if you like what I'm doing please let me know with a subscription or liking my videos or favoriting them or whatever it doesn't typically matter the comments are probably the most important thing to me because it just makes me feel warm and fuzzy inside so uh, yeah I'll see you guys next time whenever that'll be so remember to have a good day